Yeah, look, it's, I think it's been very good so far. We've pushed the guys a bit. Um, you know, we spoke about uh, being open to a few changes. Um, you know, I think the, the guys are really keen to try to turn things around uh, the sort of the whole view of South African cricket. Um, so they came in with a good attitude. Uh, they, I think they were ready for a few challenges uh, that, we, that we put uh, to them. Um, we've had some good chats. Uh, it's, it's been very focused on, on this particular test series that we're coming up against the, the, the English with. So, yeah, I'm pretty happy with where we are. It's still a bit of work to be done, uh, building it into the, into the test match. Um, but, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm happy with where we are at the moment. I think the confidence comes from your preparation. Um, you know, it's almost like preparing for an exam. You, you, if you prepare for an exam properly, you walk into the exam and uh, you feel confident about um, going into that particular test. Uh, and I, th I think for, for me, that's the most important thing over the next couple of days. Maybe the guys were a little bit confident, well, short of confidence uh, going into, uh, coming into the whole uh, series. Um, having guys like Shark, Harrow, you know, Enoch around, myself, uh, Lungers, you know, we, we're talking to the guys, um, we, we're trying to get the confidence back in them and, and making sure that we test them in areas that probably they haven't been tested before um, and make them realise that, you know, that they're very good players and, and, and that the chat is good in amongst the, the team. Um, and hopefully they'll, they'll feel that, you know, come test match time, um, that they've prepared properly uh, and then ultimately feel better about going into the game. Uh, it, it is a massive test series for us. Um, we understand that there's been a few challenges within, within the game of cricket in this country um, and we understand what our role in that is as well. As a Protea team, we can't worry about um, what's going on above us. Uh, we've got to focus on doing what we can do and, and that's bringing a, a good image back to South African cricket. And if we can pull some good results out the bag, um, I think it's going to be a, a good step forward in, in to bring that confidence back into the public and the fans. Um, I think just direction. Eh? Uh, I think for me, the you know, we've, we've prepared for, for games like this before in, in times. We've also been through tough times as well, so I think we're feeding off that experience um, in order to just say, let's, you know, let's keep the players out of, out of the mix. Uh, things like social media can, can be quite hectic at times. Um, you know, I've taken myself away from that. Uh, my biggest focus at the moment is, is on my family, first of all, and, and then these guys in this change room. Um, there's a lot of hard work that, that we've put in um, over the last couple of days and, and I believe that that's the way that we're going to go forward, um, understanding that we've got to do the dirty work um, to get us back into, into a situation to put ourselves into a good position to maybe win a first of all test and hopefully a test series in, in, in the, the next few weeks. I'm not even thinking about the test championship at the moment. Um, I think if we focus on what is important now um, and giving guys good direction about where we want to go in the first test match, that first session, the rest will take care of itself. Um, you know, I think the one thing that we try to install is good work ethic, um, good intensity of training. Uh, once we do that, uh, then we can take that into, into the middle um, and ultimately get the results and, and hopefully turn things around um, and, and turn them around very quickly. You know, we've been in situations where we've come off the back of, of um, things that haven't been too good that have happened in the game of cricket in this country. But one thing I know about South Africans is that they are resilient um, and they've got that bounce back ability. And for, for me, it's hard to try to get that bounce back ability in, into, the, into the heads of the players as, as soon as possible. And we realise that in one session, everything can, can change. The momentum could be with us. Guys are going to pick up confidence from that as well. We just need to give ourselves that opportunity um, for the change. Yeah, it's a nice setup. Um, you know, you, like you say, there's plenty of experience, but you know, I think nowadays it's not only about the experience, it's about different angles that you can look at uh, the game from. Um, you know, uh, Lunga's coming back in, into, the, into the system again. I mean, he's been here before and he's got a good relationship with the players. Having a guy like Shark, he's the most cap, cap test player. Um, in the country and probably the you know, greatest cricketer that's ever lived. So, you know, that's, that's invaluable experience. Even Paul Harris working with a guy who's sort of mentored for a while in, in Kesh um, to get Kesh's confidence back. Uh, Enoch, for me, Enoch has, has obviously been, been in, in my position before. Uh, he's been through a couple of tough times. Um, he's putting structures in, in place, which, which I'm be stupid to change because I, I do believe in the structure that, 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 that he's put in. Um, he's, he's also been a mentor to so many of the players in that dressing room. Um, for me, it's just about coming in and trying to add value where I can. Um, hopefully, I can get into a situation where you know, I can earn the players' trust over, over if, if, you know, in the ne next short while, and, and they'll have the confidence to come and, and chat to me. But um, you know, at the moment, they might have confidence in other people to, to chat to about certain issues that they've got. So, and I'd be stupid to just be the guy who comes in and try to change everything so quickly. Uh, I'm not going to be that person. I think that there's enough experience in that dressing room at the moment and enough relationships that are strong uh, in order for us to go in the right direction.